Hey guys, it's Tressa. I'm glad to have you here with me. Wanted to chat a little bit. I'm actually out in my garden and I did some pruning of my zucchini and my tomatoes. I'm picking some basil right now. And I am a mess because I also top dressed. We have a storm coming. Well, a rainstorm. I mean, nothing terrible, but we're supposed to have a lot of rain um, in the next few days. And I felt like since I had some extra soil, it would be good to get it on some of these plants so that um, I would have to keep the nutrients in and a lot of things wouldn't wash away. We had fertilized a couple weeks ago and there was still some fertilizer. So, and I just use all natural. Actually, I use a fertilizer from Coast of Maine. Um, so it's all natural. It's got worm castings and kelp and seaweed and stuff like that in it. It's really good for the garden. Anyways, so storms um, have been on my mind a lot, but not the kind of weather storms that you're thinking of. More uh, about just what's going on in the world and the heaviness. I don't know if you all feel it too, but there's this heaviness in the world right now. There's a lot going on, a lot. And I really feel like God's saying, prepare your heart, prepare your home, take care of yourself. And I feel like he's calling me to share that a bit. So I just wanted to get on and chat with you a little bit about some of the things that I'm doing um, and invite you to learn more with me. So um, gardening is a huge part of it, making sure that I've got you know, my garden to the best of what I'm going to get this year. I don't know, but whatever I get is going to be what I need. I'm sure God will provide, so I'm not worried about that. He is calling us to prepare, but he also says, do not be afraid and don't worry about anything. He's in control. I know that, so I'm not worried, but it's important for us to be in prayer, in his word, and really staying close to him in all of this, in whatever we are doing, whatever we have going on, and to really make sure that we are um, really praying, asking for what we need, but listening to him. So I've been really trying to do a really good job of really mental prayer and, oh, there are some tomato leaves, um, spending a lot of time in God's word and just really walking with Jesus through all of this. So that's part of it. And then of course, preparing, um, making sure that my pantry's well stocked. I'm going to go through and check to see what I need, maybe place an order with Azure. I had a few things that I might need. I like to make sure I keep like baking supplies and all that. I'm going to get into more detail of this in a workshop that I'm going to do um, a couple times and the information will be in the um, in the description below about when you can access that and how. And so I just felt like it would be a good thing to kind of get in a, in a workshop kind of Zoom call kind of thing where we could just really chat more about it and talk about things um, that you can do to prepare and get ready with your home, natural solutions that you can use and all that kind of thing. I don't think we need to worry. I don't think that um, it's a good thing to be afraid and to be anxious over, but you know, God tells us not to worry, but he also expects that we do what we need to do to prepare. And so um, that's where I'm coming from with all of this. I remember when in 2020, when things first went down in March of 2020 and, um, you know, people were kind of panicking and using hand sanitizer and buying toilet paper. And I was like, I think I have what I need. I have lots of natural solutions. I have essential oils and, you know, natural things that I use. And I wasn't worried and I'm not worried because I, I'm doing an even better job now of preparing and, um, whatever I get out of this garden, I'm going to harvest and I'm going to process and can or freeze or whatever I can so that I can preserve it. And if I need to buy a little extra from the farmer's market or a farm stand or uh, place an order with Azure, you can get some good things like apples and pears and fruits and vegetables from them too. So lots of good options. And I'm going to talk more in depth about all of that. So if you want to join me for that, or if you can't join me when I'm live, I'll, we'll definitely have a replay available to share with people. So, and I may even put it up here. Um, I'm not sure. I, I may just send it out to you individually, but let me know if it's something that you're interested in. And, um, but I will put the information in the description so that you can access it. And yeah, prepare your hearts and your homes. 
it's important. We need to be ready for whatever's coming. 2024 has been a wild ride and we're not done yet. And I think things are gonna get a little crazier. So we can do this together with God's help. God bless. I'll see you all soon.